Hello everyone, Grizzly Bear here, and welcome back to Sleuth News. Today, more new sets. Let's get into it. First up, let's start with the new games, or not new, but free games of the week from Epic. We got Murder by Numbers, and we got Elder Scrolls Online, both currently free for this week. Uh, there was nothing crazy on Steam. It was like a World of Ships expansion. You need the base game for it, so I can't really consider the game free. Spider-Man 2 released, one, its new trailer this week, which is amazing. And also, PS5 has announced the new uh, Spider-Man 2, uh, not set, but a uh, PlayStation console, and it looks beautiful, and I want it. Even though I said I'm waiting on a PS5, I'm, I'm just going to wait for PC. It gets painful when I see stuff like this. Moving on to different brick sets. Starting out, we have uh, some fun hole coming out next week, or not next week, next month. So first up, we have August, and I don't remember exactly the name. I, I'm pretty sure it's called Medieval Market or something like that. It's a great looking set. Looks like it'd fit in great with any medieval like city you're building. And they're actually releasing two sets next month. And the other one is this pickup truck, a little blue pickup truck, and it looks like it has little extra things with it, so you can have a little tower and stuff. I probably won't pick this one up. I might get the medieval market, but truck's kind of on for me. But it does come with a dog. And some of the Lego stuff coming out over the next couple months. First up, we got this Minecraft Iron Golem Fortress, which is pretty cool. It comes with multiple different characters. I don't know if that one's an evil one up at the top or someone all dressed up. But you got skeletons riding horse. You got a exploding creeper. It's, uh, I don't remember what it's called when you get it gets hit by lightning. An enhanced creeper, I don't know. And of course, you got your Iron Golem. You got the Mars Rover Perseverance, so this is pretty cool. I'm not sure how big it is exactly. I might look into that later, but I think this can actually move and all that, and it just it looks kind of cool. If you're into space and Technic, this would be a great set for you. This is a set a lot of people are going to be wanting. It is the Harry Potter Green Gots. I'm personally not going to get it because I'm not a huge Harry Potter person, but I think this is a pretty cool looking set where it's really large and a ton of detail. I like that they have this underneath part. Only part I don't like about it is one, it has open back, which I get because the building's way too large to close it or to have the whole building. But apparently also the top is only held in by a couple of squares, so it's probably going to be a pretty fragile set and it looks pretty top heavy. Also this week, Lego decided to give us nightmares. Enough said. <laughs> And last but not least, this comes out next month, and I'm excited. Uh, I don't. I think it's like the ski resort or something, but it just it looks so cool. Like you got bikes and skis and tubing and wall climbing and skating and just a ton of stuff packed into uh, one set, and I think it's a great set. And then moving into Grizzly Bear news, this past week I played Uncharted: Beyond Two Souls, and I'm actually fairly fairly close to beating both, which is surprising. Uh, Move on to Uncharted 2 once I finish Uncharted. I might replay Beyond Two Souls because I kind of want to do some of the other stuff in there as well. And then, not only that, I beat the world record multiple times on Wednesday with building three LEGO minifigures. Now, I will say that's just what I could find based off online rules. Uh, I don't know the actual, like, full-on rules with it. I, I would have to contact... Uh, the world record, Guinness World Records, to get the actual correct, like, rules and all that. But if I did it right, which I believe I did, I beat it multiple times and easily. So I may look into actually trying to get into Guinness World Records. I might do a couple other runs with different types of LEGO World Records before I do that because it's like a three-month process. But let me know if you think I should do that. It, it's, it's something I'm considering. This upcoming week, I'll be continuing Uncharted, Beyond Two Souls, maybe finishing it. Uh, Wednesday we'll be, play be playing Guess the Game. It's a video game guessing game, and it looks kind of fun, so I like. I want to do that. And next weekend, I'll probably build another Lego set where I'm starting to work on catching up, and so I love it. So, I think that's everything I got currently. Maybe, hopefully, and if I'm forgetting something, let me know. But, thank you all for coming out tonight. I hope everyone has a wonderful weekend, weekend and I'll see you later. Sleuth News out. Bye!